All right, this is the Algebra 2 EOC problem number 15. It says a grocery store manager wants to determine how many servings of fresh fruit her adult customers eat per day. She randomly surveys adult customers in the produce aisle of her store about their eating habits. Which statement best explains why her survey could be biased? Well, there's a couple things we need to look at. The biggest one being, what in the world is biased? Well, bias means, is it skewed in some way? Is it leaning toward one thing instead of another? Are they kind of off kilter? Well, as we go down through here and look, and look in the problem, how could this thing be biased? Well, this lady is standing in a grocery store asking people about their eating habits, but she's standing in the produce aisle. Now, I don't know about you, but if I don't like fruits and vegetables, I'm not going to hang out in the produce aisle. So it would I don't think it would have anything to do with children because you usually don't survey children anyway people get kind of freaked out when adults come up and ask their kids things you know, parents just don't like that and secondly the produce aisle contains more than just fresh fruit well yeah but that doesn't mean it's biased and adults who do not eat fresh fruit are less likely to shop at the local grocery store I don't know if I was hungry and I don't like to eat fruit that doesn't mean I'm gonna drive 20 miles out of my way to go get something else but definitely look at D. Adults who do not eat fresh fruit are less likely to be found in the produce aisle. Well, that would be the case because, like I said, if I don't want to eat fruits and veggies, I'm not going to hang out in the produce aisle where all there is is fruits and veggies. So the bias would be right there where the people who don't eat healthy aren't going to be in the healthy section of the store. So good luck.